Mommy, Daddy is not at work. <laughs> that was my eight-year-old son, Joshi. All day on Sunday, after my husband had to leave out to attend to a work matter, the little boy kept coming to me. Mommy, no, Daddy's not at work. He's not at work this long. You should call him. You should call him. He's not at work. <laughs> Guys, honestly, I am so at the point of my life of staying in God's presence and saying the devil, no, you may not have my joy today. So even though Josh is coming to me and the devil is putting these things in my head that, oh, your husband isn't at work, no, 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 no. I want to stay in God's presence no matter what because the devil is looking to see if he can get in here and if he can bring us down and get us thinking the wrong things and just having a crazy life. So we have to stay strong and we have to stay with God in every moment. So let me tell you what I did. Instead of worried about where my husband was, I spent my day with my son, Emmy, and he, we were studying for his final exams that are coming up soon. And at one point I said, Emmy, once you finish this topic, you could go on. And Emmy said, no, mom, I want to go some more. And guys, I was just filled with joy that I got to be with this great son. You know, so even though the devil tried to get me down and discouraged, I say, no, I'm going to focus. And I'm going to focus on these beautiful kids that I have here with me and then just enjoy them. And guys, I ended up having the best day. So I just want us to just focus on our families. Don't let the devil come in. Don't let the devil try to put evil thoughts in our head. If my husband said he's at work, guess what? I give him the benefit of the doubt. I don't need to call him and check on him. He's earned my trust and my loyalty and my respect. So guys, come on. we got to put our big girl pennies on and be the women that God is calling us to be. Mature. You know, not leaving our homes, let, letting the devil come in. We're fighting for our families all the way, raising the best kids and having the best marriages. All for God's glory.